Jen here. Tonight I want to give you a little tip about arm undulations. So I brought some props, we'll get to those in a second, but I wanted to kind of clarify a few things on arm undulations and hopefully correct a few things that I'm seeing online and um, in other classes. An arm undulation, just to kind of an overview of an arm undulation, a quick overview, is a rotation at the shoulder joint, an elevation of the elbow, and then I like to think of it as a relaxation back down to my countertop. So rotation, elevation, relaxation, yeah? Um, it's a small movement and it's subtle, but that's what sets it apart and that's what makes it so beautiful. A lot of people try to make that movement a lot bigger or feel or look a lot bigger than what it really needs to be. So a lot of times I see um, a little extra rotation happening or I see shoulder elevation and the shoulder needs to stay down. And one of the things I've really noticed is I'm noticing a bend in the elbow, which is bringing the forearm and hand in and out. So just note that the angle of the elbow should not change uh, in the entire arm undulation. So it's as if you're just drawing your fingers up and down a wall. Uh, so just kind of watch out for those things while you're doing your arm undulations. And if you just can't quite get the feel of an arm undulation, that's why I'm here tonight. So um, I just had a glass of wine with some lovely ladies and it reminded me that I've been wanting to, to share this with you guys. Um, think about when you pour a glass of wine, yeah? When you pour a glass of wine, you don't pour a glass of wine like this and you don't pour a glass of wine like this. And if you're trying to get the last drop out of the bottle, you certainly don't bend your elbow back and forth because you're gonna spill it everywhere. Or you're gonna waste your wine. So uh, what's going on when you're pouring a glass of wine is the same thing that's going on in the beginning of your um, arm undulation. And it's a slight rotation happening at the shoulder and then an elbow lift so that you can pour your wine, right? And then maybe you're trying to get the last drop. Oh, and then you bring it back down. Obviously you don't drop your elbow, but you bring your, your bottle back down to your countertop. Um, so, try it out. Get a glass of wine, get a bottle of wine. It might take you three or four tries to try and get that feeling of an arm undulation. But I wanted you guys to kind of have that connection so you can understand how that feeling is and how it's really a natural thing, right? So don't, don't over extend and don't try so hard. Just make it a natural feel. If wine is not your thing, you know, water, LaCroix, whatever. Um, so anyways, cheers. Hope that was helpful. If you have any questions, please feel free to message me, email me, text me, whatever. And I will absolutely um, get right back to you. Okay, thanks. Cheers.